Hello everyone, what's going on? I'm Gaff the Master 974 back again today and welcome to another Source Shorts video and today The sun is leaking As you can see right here it is a meme that is going around as a result of some shenanigans with the Half-Life 2 overcharged mod and no click of course for being awesome and pointing out stuff like this and I have been asked to kind of look into this and that is what I'm going to be doing today because this is obviously not the overcharged mod but this is happening in a Source 2013 mod and it does look bad and to be honest I don't know how to fix this but hopefully by raising awareness of this someone with some knowledge may actually know how to resolve this issue. So if we, for example, just take a look outside and you can see the city plaza, then what you can see is there's some much better looking shadow work going on. And this actually has something to do with the whole the sun is leaking. thing. Now, if we go over to this area, then we could probably see that there's, again, nicer shadow work going on. So... If you ask me, I think that what I'm going to be talking about is the reason why the whole the sun is leaking thing is happening. So what I'm going to have to do is go to my game capture right here and load up this. So this is a project by Selisage567 over on GitHub and it is called Fake CSM Map Base. Now, if you don't know what CSM is, it stands for Cascaded Shadow Mapping, and it is something that is a feature in newer Source Engine games like Black Mesa or Counter-Strike Global Offensive before it became Counter-Strike 2. But um, because real Cascaded Shadow Mapping cannot be integrated into older Source mods, you have to resort to a fake effect, essentially. So what uh, Seller Sedge did here is based the cascaded shadows off of the nth projected texture entity. So that is why the effect looks the way that it does, and presumably why it has the issues that it does. And um, yeah, I am using the recommended settings as laid out here, and it still causes these kind of light bleeding issues. So because this only works for map base, you need to use the map base code, which is just a fork of the uh, source SDK 2013 code that Valve provides. So if you want to get your own the sun is leaking stuff at home, then you download the map base code as you know, just click on this button, click download zip, and you did the very same sort of thing over here with the fake CSM map base and then just extract the files and then you'd copy paste the contents of this folder so you know copy the client to the client code materials into your mods sort of actual materials folder and then server into the server code so if i just go down here real quick then we can see that this is just for hammer that you need to load up later so when talking about copying and pasting the code you'd go into your sort of folder where the map base single player code is or multiplayer then src game and you'd have your client and server over here and you just copy and replace copy and paste replace excuse me and then in the game folder you can go to mod episodic or mod hl2 go to materials and paste in the uh you know the tools folder there so that's how you can at least integrate the features and then if you go to visual studio then all you need to do is right click on the server project go to add and then existing item and then you just navigate to where you added the files so in this case it would just be env cascade light on the server and then on the client you do the same sort of thing it'll just be c underscore env cascade light uh, i've already done this so that's why i'm not going to go into that here and then to actually get the cascaded shadow mapping effect to work you need to go into a map of some description so as you see i was in train station 02 
So I added a end cascade light entity around here. I didn't outline how you can add the end cascade light entity into hammer because this would be undefined and unrecognized. So what you can do is go to this tools menu up here, go to options, and then you'd see all your configurations up here and you just go to the game data files, go to add, and then you just go to the csm.fgd file and that would add the end cascade light and all of the variables and parameters and stuff that you can modify and then you can place it in the map and follow what I'm just going to tell you and you pretty much want to have the same properties as a standard light environment entity that exists in the map but I think you want to make sure that the pitch I think it is is you know reversed from what it actually is in the light environment entity i'm just trying to find one of those entities so i can prove the points but uh not finding one around here sadly but yeah normally that would be like minus 35 so you just want it to be positive 35 instead that's that's the gist of it i'll go there all right there it is okay so just go there and then yeah see pitch is minus 35 and the middle value stays at 165 and keep the color. So you want to give this alpha, this last 15, uh, a low value like 15, because if you go to super high values, then you're just going to make your map look like a nuclear bomb went off. So that's just not what you want to do. And the results of which are what happens when you boot into a, a mod, as you see here. So while the shadows might look nicer you do get this sort of a uh, the sun is leaking effect going on and you know how you can fix this well i say i know i don't know how to but one really simple fix to do is to go to the command csm underscore enable give that a value of z zero excuse me and um yeah there you go the sun is no longer bleeding it is not an issue with the level design or the maps as far as I can tell. It is more an issue with the fake cascaded shadow mapping effect. That must have been implemented into overcharged and that is something I don't know how to fix. But if someone knows how to, then please let us know what we can do to try and fix this and stop this from happening and that's really all there is to it um so yeah hopefully you found this helpful and the sun is leaking guys don't know what else to say take care of there peace out and see you later